All right, so this is gonna be one of those videos where I just speak my mind because I have something to say. And I've been thinking about something for quite a bit and I just wanna, you know, talk about it. <laughs> I have no idea why you watch me. Yeah, so this is gonna be one of those videos where it's gonna be a little bit more personal and it's gonna be completely unscripted and unplanned because I just have something going on in my mind that I've been thinking about for a while and I wanna talk about it. And that is, Precisely what I said in the intro, I have no idea why you watch me. Because I'm interested in doing so many different things, right? Most of which are associated with art, so at least that's one thing, right? But there's this end where I want to talk about like tutorial type things and cameras and editing and video and photo and whatnot. And then there's another part of me that wants to actually make the stuff like short films and cinematic journal type things that I've been making recently. And there's that musician in me that very much just wants to make covers sometimes. And then this, this version of me where I just like to talk about the things that are on my mind. And I have no idea how each and every one of those things still gets decent viewership for my small channel. Because here's the thing, my goal is that I can at least get 100 views within like the first day or two that my video is uploaded and then I'll be happy. As long as all my videos are above 100 and that that's above board for me, that's, that's good enough. So it, it confuses me because I do the videos that I feel like doing. And sometimes I feel like, oh, this, this one's gonna do really well. And then there are those videos where I think, oh, nobody's gonna care about this, but I'm gonna put it out anyway because like I, I want to. And then those still get the same amount of support and attention and it confuses me because I'm like I was so worried that I wouldn't reach my goal of like 100 views and yet here we are with people messaging me about how what I had to say that was completely personal to me I thought actually resonated with them I'm like first of all that's great because my aim is to at least touch one person's life to know that there's more than one is really actually massive to me so yeah it, it, I just wanted to say that it really, really does confuse me. Uh, what keeps people watching? What keeps you watching? Because I don't know which kind of content that I make that people like the most. I can't really tell. And I don't know if people are just tuning in because they enjoy watching me, period. You know, as much as I play up being egotistical and narcissistic and all that, that's just a thing that I do because I find it to be fun and it throws people off balance and that's really entertaining for me. But I'm highly critical of myself. The truth of the matter is I don't expect people to care at all. I don't expect people to pay attention at all. Kind of that thing of like, don't expect anything and you won't be disappointed type deal. But also just because I don't think that I'm so special that people are just gonna flock and listen to everything that I have to say with interest. And yet, people are paying attention to the things that I do no matter how much I anticipate them to fail. So it really surprises me how you're still tuning in, regardless of how simple the topic is or how simple my production quality is for that given day or that given video. And yeah, it, it honestly confuses me. I have no idea why that is. So I'm putting this out here in the hopes that I can actually hear back from at least like two of you or five <laughs> as to what keeps you watching because it really does make me curious and it would definitely help me understand more what's going on. <laughs> so in reality what I really wanted to say for as small as my channel is and as small as my viewership really is in the grand scheme of things I'm making this video not just to say that I'm utterly utterly confused which I am but also to say thank you to the people who have stuck around who really do take the time out of their day to message me about how one of my videos or films impacted them or how much they enjoyed a cover that I did it means a lot. It's very reassuring to know that there are people out there who are watching and enjoying, not just hate watching. <laughs> because at the end of the day, what I'm really trying to do with this channel is to create a place that people can go to when they just want to have a good time, when, you know, they want to relax or learn something in a way that they won't be bored. That's, that's really what I want to do at the end of the day, and my only goal is to get at the very least 100 views per video. I think is it's not as easy as I often explain it to be, or that I expect it to be because I don't just want to put out videos for the sake of consistency. I want to put out videos that are of value, of entertainment, that don't waste people's time. Not mine, not yours. And so, yeah, it means a lot to me to know that there's a considerable amount of people paying attention and enjoying the stuff that I do enough to constantly tell me in each and every outing and for a good amount of you 
to also tell me that despite me not really feeling it when I'm working on these videos, that every single video that I put out feels like it tops the other. And that's really encouraging. And I wanted to make this video just being grateful for all of that. It's not something that I usually end up saying in real life. <laughs> It's not something that I often end up having the opportunity to say in something like an Instagram story or a post on Instagram because really, I don't expect a lot of people to view my stories with sound on or bother to read the captions. I felt like putting it out here on YouTube for people to see without it having to expire in 24 hours or buried down the feed is my way of saying thanks along with my expression of my confusion as to why you actually enjoy the stuff that I do and why you keep tuning in. I have no idea. I would definitely love to hear it and I'd love to hear what you'd want to see too. So this is really a very simple video that's just kind of like a video journal to update you on what's on my mind. I love doing these videos because because, well, for one, they're very easy to do, but also often because I get the most conversations and engaging feedback when it comes to me just opening up my mind with the random little things that I have. So if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram at Sentient Poison, Nat Nicholas Allen, and let me know what you think. You don't have to comment, you can message me, do whatever you want. I'd appreciate hearing from you, much like I always do. Cheers.